Foghorn one. For those of you who know Hanji, you would know that she loves to feed. To a point where we're actually hosting uh, at our house pre-COVID, she would actually cook more food so there's leftover that she can pack up and send with you along for you to enjoy for the next few days. Now, on this channel, we've covered up some of her big hitters, like the Kati Dal, the Bagari Bagan, and the Mirchunga Salad, and Shami Kebab, and the list goes on. But today, we're actually covering the biggest daddy of them all. This is Kari. So now, this is special for a few reasons. First of all, Hanji's perfected the art to actually make the curry in an oven. She has a few reasons for that. First of all, it frees up space around the stoves for you to cook the pakoras, the bagar, and so on and so forth. Also, she believes it's less monitoring because you don't have to keep stirring uh, and manage as the pot boils. So as it cooks away in the oven, you just have to stir it a couple of times and you're good. And last but not least, she put some oil at the bottom. This also makes sure that in the oven, it doesn't stick to the pan, which whoever is cooking gutty knows how important that is. Now let's go take a look at how Hanji makes this gutty. And for the taste test, we have a very special guest once again. Nimra from Decor Diva is not only Rafia's high school friend, but she's never had curry before. We can't wait to see her reaction. I'm sure you can't either. Let's go take a look. Thank you. 
don't forget to subscribe, like our video, and leave a comment. Assalamualaikum. Today I'll be testing the Betty Cardi from Customer Seas. Full disclaimer, I've never had Cardi before, but there's a first time for everything, so here we go. Um, I'm trying it on the gel, which I'm guessing is the traditional way to create. Mm. This tastes really good. I'm gonna have one more bite. I'm gonna dig into the sephora part of it. I really really like it. Um, let's talk about the flavor first. So it's nice and flavorful. It has just the right amount of kick to it without being overly spicy. Um, not bland at all by any means. You can taste the curry that I did, but not to the point where it's overbearing or overpowering to your taste buds. The um, texture is nice and creamy. The pakora was pretty moist. Um, you can feel the, the creaminess of the yogurt, which is really nice and comforting. And yeah, this is really good. I never thought I would be a curry fan, but Hassan, it seems like you've converted me, so great job. And and uh, for and let's go take a look <laughs> 